All right, y'all, welcome back. Uh, today, I'm here. We're going to go over the solar lights. Uh, our good friends at T-Sun sent us a whole bunch of Kropow uh, solar lights, right? So we're going to go over them. We're going to unbox them, check them out. Mason's here today with me. He wanted to do a video today, so uh, yeah. that's pretty exciting. You know, we're not we're not doing fireworks, and he's still out here. Yeah, because uh, me and Nate with it a long time. That's right. He hasn't made a video in a long time, so... Uh, let's go ahead and unbox these. These are the black housing, and these are the blue ones. Can you do the cotton? Why, why me not um, a Nate want a little though? Be telling me how to talk. That's right. He's in school, so he doesn't have time to make all these videos, right? Yeah. So these oh. are the blue ones. There's eight in a pack here. We're going to go ahead and open this up. So in the package, it was wrapped in here. You get two double-sided tapes and some screws, right? So you can you can mount these in multiple different ways. Uh, right off the bat, this is nice and heavy. It's solid. Oh, yeah. uh, it's got a nice solid frame to it. The bottom's plastic, which is fine. This top, I don't know what it is. Maybe molded plastic or aluminum. I'm not 100% mm -hmm. sure, guys, but Let's uh, let's turn it on. So that's the blue light. That looks pretty good. Oh, we have a D one. Yeah. So this this pack right here is the green ones, and we're just gonna put that over there. And let's see. So I already took them out because I was just like, I'm not gonna unbox, you know, 24 lights for you guys, right? So yeah. this is this one's green. Uh, this one's an aluminum finish with the green light. Yeah. That one's kind of okay. cool. And then the last pack right here of eight lights is the white one, right? Yeah. So this got a black eight. black aluminum frame, maybe. I, I want to say it's aluminum. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, it definitely feels super solid. And we're definitely going to test that out. So that's the that's the white light, right? Um, so right off the bat, I'm going to say these are not spotlights. Okay. But me date me date that would be ten out of ten. This is ten out of ten? Well yeah. Mason gives it ten out of ten. Uh but you know, you guys I'm gonna give you my honest opinion. And these are not that bright. I'll tell you that right off the bat. Uh these would probably definitely be good to mark off a uh you know, like a walking path or something like that. Well well they're still good. Yeah, they're good. They're definitely good, but yeah. you know, uh I like the I like the quality. As usual, everything I've gotten from Kerpal uh, has been top quality. So it could be a nightlight. It could be a nightlight. Maybe Mason will use it as a nightlight, right? So well, I think you got plenty of nightlights, though. Don't you have plenty of nightlights? <laughs> you don't? Yeah, we have Guys, you guys see the other videos. I mean, we have lights all over this house, so I don't know what he's thinking over here. But uh, so yeah, that's that's the unboxing. Now we're gonna go ahead and. Uh, I guess we're gonna set these up in the front. I got too many lights in the backyard right now. So I think we're gonna set these up in the front, test them out. One thing I definitely gonna try is, uh, you guys follow the link in the description and you'll see, if you go to their, their page and you look and it shows like a car running this over, but it's a picture. I'm actually gonna run these over. I wanna see what they do. Uh, because if somebody advertises it that they're basically indestructible, we're gonna test it, right? So. Uh, that's it. We're gonna go set these up in the front. Okay, and... tighten it. Tighten it. What? That way. Oh, sorry. What's the matter? In my tan. Oh, you're tan moved? <laughs> oh, okay. All right, here's tan moved. So we're gonna go set these up in the front, and we're gonna test them out, and uh, we'll be right back. Alright y'all, so you guys seen, I just literally ran it over four times, right? So, let's see, look at that. Perfectly fine, no damage whatsoever. So, uh, they're definitely tested by me right here, you guys just seen it. Uh, definitely worth it, solid. 
looks good. The light's pretty cool. Alright y'all, so here's a little look at them set up. I put them along my my sidewalk here, going into the backyard. And uh, they're definitely pretty cool. They're not too bad. And look, check him out. He's my little friend. He's going to be joining us for the video tonight. He's a big guy, isn't he? I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's kind of dark. But yeah, these are these are pretty nice. I like them. They definitely light up. And then obviously you guys see the RGBs in the background. Uh, these are the RGB solar floodlights also. Super bright. They definitely uh, look good along the side of the house. Lights it up real nice. And then uh, this is a little plant here. This gets all types of flowers. And, you know, it's lighting up this flower right here. Then back here we got some more bushes that it that it lights up. So they definitely look pretty nice. And these, I have them on the grass right now. I can put them on the put them on the sidewalk here. Let's see if you guys can see that a little bit better. So it does like a little design, a pattern. Um, you know, there's multiple uses for these guys. These are the blue ones. You could put these on your you could put these on your patio. You can put them on top of your fence posts. Uh, I actually have a fence post right here. We could try it out. Let's go ahead. Well, that light's still working. A little motion light, but we'll go in the backyard. Let's see. Let's put it up here. All right. So that's the that's it on top of the fence post. It don't really have a lot of light, guys. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's not very bright. This is more of a uh, you know just to mark out your pathway, I guess. Let's see. So I got a, we did a patio in the back here. Yeah, so I guess I could outline it. I'm not gonna lie, they're, they're definitely not that bright. Uh, they're good, obviously you've seen the quality, I already ran them over. Uh, they're definitely solid, there's no doubt about that, but definitely not bright. So if you're looking for something to light up an area, uh, these are not gonna be for you. I would definitely go with the uh, solar spotlights that I have out here. You know, I just showed you guys those, and then this, the RGB, and I'm going to show you the white ones in a minute. Uh, but those look pretty good. I mean, they're definitely, you know, you guys can see in the back. Those are the lights I did on the fence like a week or two ago. Those are bright. You know, they actually add a, a difference to the yard. But these are the blue ones. We'll check out the green ones and we'll check out the, the, the white ones in a minute here. So, be right back. All right, so now we went ahead and put the green ones on the opposite side of the driveway here. You guys can see them. I, f I feel like the green is definitely a little brighter than the blue. You can see all the way to the end of the driveway. So these will definitely work for lighting a path. Uh, you know, I'm not going to say they're super bright and they're going to light up the area around you. Uh, I have a street light right across the street, as you can tell. So my front yard doesn't get very dark. And it's really not pitch black out tonight. It's pretty clear out. So, but you could definitely see. I'll go down here and I'll turn back around. But you could see, you could definitely make them out. So if you were using it for, you know, like a walkway or, or you know, putting along your walkway so you have a guiding point to where you're gonna walk and stuff. I think these would be great. Uh, definitely. So I'm gonna go ahead and get these white ones set up and we'll check those out. Alright y'all, so here's the white ones. I just put them around the garden area. Uh, you can see them, there's no doubt about it. But look, if you if you if I get close up guys, it only lights up about two inches maybe around the around the lights. So one thing I would suggest is they're marketing these as spotlights. Uh I I'll be totally honest with you guys, these are definitely not spotlights. I don't think they're bright. I don't think they they're bright at all. I mean, you could see them, but if you were trying to light a path, if you were trying to light up your deck or something like that, this would definitely not do it. Uh, they're cool and all, and you know I really appreciate them sending them to me, checking them out. But honestly, guys, I really have to say that they're just not bright. Uh, so I definitely wouldn't call them spotlights. I would say you know ambient light or or, or something like that and. 
you know, it, it's pretty dark outside my house right now, and I'll bring this over here so you guys can see it yourself. So this is about what I'm lighting up, and you guys can tell it's really not that much of a difference. Uh, but yeah, so that's it for these. Uh, I'm gonna come back and I'll show you guys a couple more lights and and stuff like that on the next video. But I'm gonna wrap this video up here and say if you guys are looking for like a ambient light or something, you know, maybe marking your your pathway or something like that, I would go with these lights. But other than that, I could definitely could not recommend these uh, to light up an area or anything like that. Uh, unfortunately, you know obviously you guys seen the quality is there they're definitely heavy duty lights and they can withstand you know a pretty good beating that i showed you guys but uh other than that you know compared to something like this which is their product also uh it lights up the whole house you know what i mean and that's that's beautiful and changes colors and it's real nice so uh that's it you know i appreciate you guys stopping by as always and, you know, I hope everybody's staying safe. And, uh, you know, thank you for stopping by. And leave me some comments. Start leaving me some comments, guys, because I'm having an issue. Uh, I'm not really getting a lot of comments and stuff. And I would really appreciate the feedback on, you know, how I'm doing with the channel and maybe something that you guys want to see or anything like that. You know, the busy season is going to be kicking up real soon. I'll be doing fireworks again. And then, you know, after fireworks, we go right into you know planning for halloween so that i have like some exciting videos coming up for that but uh you know drop me some comments you know i don't care what it is if you hate the channel you know whatever let me know let me know something uh, i would greatly appreciate it but uh you know as always uh you know i appreciate you guys and uh hope to see you all in the next video thanks for watching